As we come to the end of the year, it's time again to look back and be thankful for all the wonderful moments that we were blessed to be a part of. It's been a challenging year at times, but things are looking up for our country. Only a few days after the holiday season ends, Congress will come back to work with a new Senate majority ready to take action and seriously address the pressing issues facing our country. I'm optimistic that we'll be able to make some real progress on the issues that matter. It's an honor to serve our state in the United States Senate for the next six years. As Diane and I prepare to celebrate the holiday season with our family in Wyoming, we send our best wishes to all those who are spending this special time of year with their loved ones. Being back home means so very much to us. There's no greater family tradition than being home for the holidays. We do want to thank our veterans and those currently serving overseas who continue to protect and preserve our way of life. The holidays can be a difficult time for those separated from their families, and we pray that when they've completed their service, God will bring them all safely home again. Wherever you're spending your holiday season, Diane and I wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. The sound of those special words brighten the day and lift my spirits. God bless.